Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Hi Mathematics and today we have a really interesting and relaxing challenge which one is bigger? On the left side we have 2 to the power 100 factorial and on the right side we have 2 to the power 100 by factorial we have right here. So what is the correct answer? What do you think about it? Write your thoughts down into the comment section, you can also pause the video and we will check your answers here in just one minute so it will be really interesting. So first of all let's look closely to our left hand side. What do we have right here on the left hand side? Let's write right here our left hand side, so our left left hand side what do we have right here we have 2 to the power 100 factorial okay and this factorial can be rewritten in another way so for example 4 factorial can be written as 4 times 3 factorial and in the same way let's rewrite our 100 factorial but how can we write it we can write it as 2 to the power 100 times 99 99 factorial. Okay, let's rewrite it, this challenge like that. This is absolutely the correct thing. If we write it in another way, we have this expression. So it changed nothing for us. Right now, let's remember a really great power rule. So because of a power rule, we can write it as 2 to the power 100 raised to the power 99 factorial. Okay, we can write this question like that. If we write it in another way, we can also multiply. So we have absolutely the same thing. All the time we have equal sign. So this is our left hand side. What about right hand side? Let's look closely to our right hand side. So right, right hand side. What do we have right here? We have this expression on the right hand side. 2 to the power 100. And we have right here we have factorial. Okay, everyone should know that factorial can be written as a product from 1 until this number. So as a result right here, let's apply this rule, the common factorial rule, the classic case. So this will be equal to 2 to the power 100, yeah, 2 to the power 100 times a less by 1, okay, 2 to the power 100 minus 1, yeah, times 2 to the power 100 minus 2, yeah, and times a lot of this all the way, all the way down right here, times, times 3, times 2, and times 1. Okay, this is our expression that we really need right now. But if you look closely, this is a very complicated expression. It's really hard to work with that because right here we have very huge numbers. We don't have like a pattern right here. So right now let's use another expression. So this expression will be less than, or this expression that I'm going to write right now is bigger than. So this expression is less than 2 to the power 100, yeah? times instead of this expression let's write 2 to the power 100 which is obviously greater than this expression once more 2 to the power 100 and times instead of this 3 we have 2 to the power 100 times instead of 2 we have 2 to the power 100 and instead of 1 we have 2 to the power 100. As you can see this expression is 100% bigger than this one because every elements every expression if you if you look at this pattern, this is absolutely the same, but after this expre after second expression, this is greater than this one, this is greater than this one, and obviously, uh, right here, this is greater than that expression. And right now, this expression will be equal to, so this expression is equal to 2 to the power 100, yeah? Raised to the power, right here we have 2 to the power 100 elements, so 2 to the power 100, okay? So this expression is equal to this one. And right now, the main thing right here. Let's, in, instead of this left-hand side, instead of this left expression, let's use this one. Let's do this. So instead of this uh, expression, let's use this one. 2 to the power 100 raised to the power 99 factorial. 99 factorial. And instead of right, right expression on the right-hand side, let's use this expression, which is bigger than this expression that we have exactly right here, but this is bigger than this one. And if we prove that the expression on the left-hand left side is greater than this one, then we can easily say that the whole expression on the left-hand side is greater than this one, and obviously 100% is greater than this one, so the exact expression that we have right here, okay? So instead of left-hand side, we use this one, exactly the same expression, but instead of right-hand side, let's use this one, which is greater than that, okay? So on the right side we have 2 to the power 100, okay, 2 to the power 100, raised to the power 2 to the power 100, okay? Okay, I hope you understand this step. This is a very tricky moment, so I hope you understand this. Right now, if you look closely, we have 2 to the power 100 right here and 2 to the power 100 for right here. So the same basis. So right now, let's try to compare, let's try to um, find the exact um, the inequality with these powers. So 99 factorial we have on the left side, Okay, 99 factorial on the left side, and on the right side we have 2 to the power 100, 2 to the power 100. And right now, what is bigger? 
this on the left or this on the right. I hope you understand that factorial uh, function is way faster than exponential function. This exponents right here, this is factorial, and factorial function is way faster than exponential function. Okay, so we can easily put this sign right here, but let's prove it because a lot of students don't understand why the factorial function is faster. So instead of 99 factorial, let's write this expression. So 99 factorial, let's write this expression. So what do we have right here? 99, yeah, 99 times 98 times 97, yeah, times times 4 times 3. So right here we have all the way down, 4, 3, 2, and, and 1. And instead of this 2 to the power 100, 2 to the power 100 right here, let's write the same thing. So over here we have exponential function, so we have 2 times 2 times 2, 100 times. So we have 2 times 2 times 2 times, right here, right here, right here, all the way down, 2 times 2 times 2 and times 2. Right now, let's look closely right here. Obviously, only these two values is the same or great or less than this one because right here two is absolutely the same okay let's write it here the two is absolutely the same and only one case when two is greater than one but it changed nothing for us because if you look closely right here three is greater than two two is uh, four is greater than two and all the way down right here the top pattern is greater than the bottom pattern this is obvious obvious thing so we hope you understand this this uh, moment why 99 factorial is way faster than exponential function so right here let's write our final answer 99 factorial is greater than this power and obviously if power is greater what power is greater then expression is greater so right here this expression is greater but it's not the expression that we found before because okay left hand side is absolutely the same bus but right here we plug in this expression so which is greater than this one and because this expression is greater than this expression which is greater than the expression that we have exactly on the right side then we can easily find that this expression is greater than exactly expression uh, exactly the same expression that we have on the right hand side so right here we have 2 to the power 100 factorial is greater than 2 to the power 100 right here we have factorial this is my approach there are a lot of approaches to this challenge and i want to see your approach in the comment section what do you think is a correct approach maybe you have a faster approach this is my approach i like this approach so much because this is for me this is clean and this is fast okay because um, it's, it's easy to see what expression is greater in this approach of course i want to see your approach what do you think about the correct solution to this challenge and thank you for your time, have a great day, see you in the next videos, and I hope you understand this explanation. You can also write a question down into the comment section what you think is a correct, a correct uh, answer. If you have a question about factorial, if you have expression with this moment, because a lot of students confused with this part. And I want you to, I wanted to explain you this part, because if you look closely, this expression is really hard to work with, okay? It's really hard to compare right here, and if you write this expression, this, which is much better for us in terms of comparing two expression, which is much better because right here we have one value and right here we have this value, which is really hard to compare. And we, right now we compare left expression, right here we simplify this, and we compare right expression, which is greater than this expression, okay? So if we, if we, if we claim that, if we prove that this expression is greater than this one, then 100% this expression will be greater than this one in the beginning because of this inequality inequality sign because of this greater sign right here so right now what do we have right here we have this expression the same basis and we need to compare our powers 99 factorial on the left side and and 2 to the power 100 right here and uh, i hope you understand why factorial function is way faster than exponential function so this is not works only in in terms of huge number in terms of low number for example we have five and two to the power five something like that the factorial function is way faster maybe you, you can't see it in the beginning but in the in the continue in terms of huge values in terms of huge values of x a factorial function is way faster than exponential function so our left expression is greater than right expression and our correct answer, 2 to the power 100 factorial, is greater than 2 to the power 100, and we have right here factorial. I hope your answer is the same as mine, but definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. Write your question down into the comment section, write your suggestion down. Maybe you have your challenges, your question. It will be really interesting to solve it on my channel with factorials, with, with uh, comparing two numbers, which one is bigger. It will be really interesting to read about it. 
and also thank you for your time have a great day see you in the next video thank you for your support and hope you enjoyed these videos hope you enjoyed this content i have a lot of videos on my youtube channel i have a lot of a ton of content about really interesting challenges every day so i hope you will enjoy it so thank you for your time see you in the next videos and have a great day